Hey, it's Dr. Jason Hall, jhallmd.com, and today we're going to talk a little bit about laser treatments, especially facial laser treatments. Now, we use a lot of different lasers in plastic surgery, um, and so it's, I think, one of the most important things that we need to do before we talk about the laser is talk about what kind of laser we're using. There are lots of different lasers, and just because we say something is a laser doesn't mean that it's necessarily better. Um, today, there are two types of laser treatments out there. There are ablative lasers, which essentially strip the surface of the skin off and let you heal, which takes you know up to two weeks sometimes um, for you to heal to the point where you can wear makeup versus a non-ablative laser, which treats the undersurface of the skin and is much less aggressive. Um, today, we're going to be using the laser genesis, which is a non-ablative laser treatment. Um, what that does is it heats up the undersurface of the skin, heats up the, the part of the skin that gives um, it its elastic qualities. So will help to treat fine lines and wrinkles, will also help to really overall improve the tone and complexion of your skin. Doesn't treat color, um, but can also be used as an acne treatment or part of an acne treatment plan because it heats up the part of the skin where the sweat glands and where the bacteria that cause acne live and can help to kill those. Laser Genesis has gotten a lot of hype recently in some of these uh, lifestyle publications like People Magazine um, because there, a lot of celebrities are using this as a pre-red carpet treatment. Um, it's great for things like that. You can do it the day of an event um, and really brightens your skin for that day. Um, but for best results, that day of event needs to be the fifth or sixth treatment um, in a series of treatments which are spaced about a month to six weeks apart. So why don't we go into the treatment room and we'll watch um, me getting the laser genesis treatment. Okay, so we're here in the procedure room. Um, we're getting ready to not, hopefully not melt my face with the laser genesis. Um, as I was saying earlier, laser genesis is a non-ablative laser treatment, so theoretically it doesn't damage the surface of the skin. Um, what it, it really works by heating the, the undersurface of the skin to tighten the skin, um, and that's actually where it works for acne as well, because it heats the sweat glands where the acne bacteria live to kill them. Um, and so with laser genesis, in maintenance therapy, we typically recommend treating people about once every four to six weeks. Um, and if you haven't ever had this before, a series of about six treatments um, is our typical treatment package. So we'll get me in position, um, get the camera set up, and let you see what a treatment look like this looks like. Okay, we're getting ready to start the laser genesis treatment, and Keila just nicely reminded me that I needed to clean my face off before we do this because if you have anything on your face that absorbs a laser light and the treatment either doesn't work or it works way too well and causes burns which I don't really want. So I'm just going to kind of clean my face off and I don't wear makeup just in case you're wondering. Okay. There we go. Um, now I get to put on my sexy spa glasses. And Keela's gonna remember that even though I look kind of goofy with a beard, I like my beard here. And so she's gonna stay away from those spots. So as you can see, this is this is pretty tolerable. Um, all I'm feeling right now is this is just a little warm. It will get hot here in just a minute, and 
I kind of tell everybody, guys are much wimpier than women when it comes to pain. So I'll probably have to stop a time or two in each little area before she puts enough laser energy into the skin to make a difference. Not to be sexist, but most women can do this without having to stop. And that's getting too hot. Okay, go ahead. And when we're doing these treatments, you, you may be thinking, well, what, how does he know you can't really see anything happening? How do you know when to stop? And really when uh, we try and put a certain amount of energy into each area that we're treating. Um, with laser genesis, um, we measure that in terms of the number of pulses that go into each area. And we try and keep those on the low end at about 500 pulses per area and on the high end at about a thousand. So as you can see, I'm a little red, a little bit, um, but overall it's a pretty easy treatment to take. Um, you saw about how long it takes um, in a full face laser. It takes a little bit less time, um, but you know, typically it's a, it's a pretty easy procedure for the benefits. Uh, and this is really, in our practice, has augmented or replaced uh, a lot of superficial chemical peels uh, because of the really the outstanding results that we can get.